to the Russia investigation. ABC News learning tonight that Steve Bannon will talk with investigators from the special counsel after Bannon was subpoenaed to appear before a grand jury. Here's ABC senior justice correspondent Pierre Thomas with what we've learned tonight. Tonight, Steve Bannon at the center of the Russia investigation. ABC News learning special counsel Robert Mueller issued a subpoena to the president's former chief strategist to appear before a grand jury. Sources familiar with the investigation say Bannon has now worked out an agreement with the special counsel for a voluntary interview. At issue, Bannon's alleged explosive comments in the book Fire and Fury, calling Don Jr.'s infamous Trump Tower meeting with the Russians treasonous. Alleged comments that led the president to give Bannon that new nickname, Sloppy Steve. That's why Sloppy Steve is now looking for a job. This coming just 24 hours after Bannon was grilled on Capitol Hill for more than 10 hours. And again, something very unusual. You subpoenaed him in the midst of the session. That's never happened. Now, we've been at this for about 10 months. Uh, that has never happened with a witness. But the session left members of both parties fuming after Bannon appeared to assert executive privilege, refusing to answer questions about the transition or his time at the White House. I am frustrated whenever people assert privileges that do not exist. There were a number of times, I think, when we recessed uh, when uh, Mr. Bannon's counsel sought the advice of the White House. Today, the White House facing questions about why Bannon's attorney was on the phone with the White House several times during the marathon session. Sometimes they actually have a White House attorney present in the room. This time it was something that was relayed via phone. Tonight, the White House insists they have nothing to hide. So let's get to Pierre Thomas live on the Hill. And Pierre, this showdown continuing to unfold between Bannon and members of Congress. They're now calling Bannon back to the Hill after he refused to answer questions yesterday. David, Bannon could be back here as early as this week, but Congressman Schiff told us if Bannon continues to refuse to answer questions, Schiff says he may lobby his Republican colleagues to consider taking this matter to court. David. Pierre, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.